welcome back to Yoga with Janine. My name is Janine Morocco and I am here to guide you through your yoga practice today. We are going to start at the top of our mat. Take a moment to arrive. Ground through your feet. Maybe lift up all of your toes and then lower them from the pinky toe all the way into the big toe. Legs are active. Slight tuck of the tailbone so that your pelvis is neutral. Arms down by your side, palms face forward. Let's bring your shoulders all the way up to the ears and then drop them down the back. Chin is parallel to the ground. Lift through the crown of your head. Let's find our breath. Inhale through the nose. Exhale out the mouth, let it go. Two more like that, big inhale. And exhale. Inhale through the nose. Exhale out the mouth. Starting with Suri Namaskar A, Sun Salutation A. On your inhale, reach the arms up overhead, palms connect. Exhale, hand to the heart. Inhale, reach your arms up. Exhale, forward fold. Take your time with it. Release your hands down to the mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Fingertips might come to your shins. Exhale to fold. Plant your hands. Step your feet back into your plank pose. You always have the option to lower your knees. And then using your inhale, shift the shoulders slightly past the wrists. Exhale, lower all the way to the belly. Inhale for cobra, lift your heart. On your exhale, tuck the toes, lift the hips up and back, down dog. Let's take a moment to find this shape in a way that feels best for you. Creating this upside down V. Allow big bends through the knees. And you lift your hips a little bit higher. Pull your heart closer to your thighs. Inhale, rise to your tippy toes, gaze forward. Exhale, tiptoe your way to the top of the mat, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, we'll slowly roll up through the spine. Reach the arms up overhead, palms connect. Exhale, hands to the heart, Samasthi Piki. Moving into Suri Namaskar B, Sun Salutation B. On your inhale, Utkatasana Chair Pose. Sink your hips low, stack your knees over your ankles. Again, find that tuck of your tailbone. Rather than having a dip in your back, we want to find one straight line of the spine. Shoulders away from the ears, reach through your fingertips. Inhale, exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Plant your hands, take it into your plank pose. Inhale, shift forward. Exhale, lower all the way or halfway chaturanga. Inhale, cobra or up dog. And exhale, down dog. Inhale, right leg rises, three-legged dog. Exhale, knee to nose. Step your foot through. Bring your left foot to a 45-degree angle. On your inhale, rise up, warrior one. Bring the palms together. Find a little back bend. Right knee stacks over your ankle. Hold for one more inhale. Exhale, plant the hands. Step it back. Lower chaturanga or all the way. Inhale through your back bend. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, left leg rises. 
Exhale, knee to nose. Step it through. Right foot 45 degrees. Inhale, rise, warrior one. Hips are square to the top of your mat. Really press down to the pinky edge of your right foot. Inhale. Exhale, release, flow through your vinyasa, making your way into down dog. A few rounds of breath here. Feel the body start to warm up. Inhale, rise to your tippy toes, gaze forward. Exhale, journey to the top of your mat, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, Utkatasana, chair pose. Exhale, Samastiti, hands to the heart. We'll start moving into our main flow now. Always remember to take it at your own pace. Listen to your body. I'm here to guide you, but always, always, always put your body and your breath first. On your inhale, reach your arms up high mountain. Exhale to fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold, plant your hands, vinyasa into down dog. Know that you can always add to your vinyasa or skip it completely. Finding our flow, inhale, right leg rises. Exhale, knee to right elbow. Inhale it up. Exhale to the left. Inhale up. Exhale, knee to nose. Step your foot through. Left foot 45 degrees. Inhale, rise up, warrior one. One round of breath, big inhale. And exhale. Hold for your inhale. Exhale, standing splits. Release your hands down, left toes up to the sky. Release your left toes to the back of the mat. Inhale, rise, high crescent. On your exhale, open up into a twist. Reach your right arm behind you, left fingertips to the top of your mat. Inhale, revolve, left arm up, right arm down. Exhale, lunge, twist. Left hand plants, right arm up to the sky. Release your right hand inside of your foot. Open up Skandasana into your right hip. Inhale, bring your hips through center. Exhale to the left. Rotate to the back of your mat. Lower your right knee down. Inhale, low lunge. Exhale, half split. Send your hips back. Lengthen through your left leg. Inhale for a low lunge. On your exhale, open up into a low warrior two. Rotate your back leg to the short edge of your mat. Inhale to reverse, sweep left arm up and back. We'll plant our right hand to the top of the mat as we lengthen through our left leg. One long line of energy from left toes through the fingertips. From here, plant your left hand to the top of your mat, tuck your left toes, hug your right knee into the chest. Inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, knee to nose. Step it through, left toes lift, standing splits. Inhale, find length. Exhale, Shiva squat, tuck left knee behind right. Inhale, standing split. Exhale, Shiva. 
Inhale, standing splits. Exhale, Shiva. This time on your inhale, open up into half moon. Feel your left hip to stack over the right. Reach your left arm up to the sky. With control, step your left foot to the back of the mat. Inhale, reverse triangle. Straighten out through your right leg. Keep rotating to the back of your mat. Right hand plants. Inhale, left arm up, lunge twist. Stay in your twist. As we inhale, rise, revolved crescent. Exhale, open up, warrior two. Inhale, lengthen through your left leg, palms connect overhead. Exhale, warrior two to the top of your mat. On your inhale, reverse warrior, sweep your left arm towards the top of the mat. Exhale, side angle. Reach left arm overhead and then right arm to the back of your mat. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, side angle. One more. Inhale. And exhale. Hold it here. Reach your right arm towards the top of the mat. And then we'll plant it outside of our right foot for a really deep extended side angle. Release your left hand down to the mat. Frame your right foot. Come into a long pyramid pose. Lengthen out through your right leg. Flex the toes towards your face. Work on having a straight spine. And then from here, ground through your hands. We're going to sweep our right leg up to the sky, three-legged dog. Inhale. On your exhale, knee to left elbow. Thread your leg through. Open up, fallen triangle. Lower your hips down to the mat. Inhale, reach both arms up. Exhale, fold over your left leg. On your inhale, windmill the arms all the way to the top of your max. We'll tuck our left toes. Inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, knee to nose. Step your foot through. Inhale, rise, high crescent. Exhale, plant your hands. Inhale, three-legged dog. And then lower your left knee down to the mat. On your inhale, reach your left arm out in front of you, sunbird balance. Exhale, tap elbow to knee. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, tap. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, lengthen, hold here, or bend through your right knee, reach around to grab hold of your foot. Release the foot if you have it, tabletop pose. Inhale, drop your belly, pull your heart through, lift your gaze for cow. Exhale, tuck the tailbone, arch your back, chin to chest cat. Inhale for cow. Exhale, cat. Inhale. And exhale. Finding a neutral tabletop, we'll tuck our toes, lift the hips up and back, down dog. Inhale, rise to the tippy toes, gaze forward. Exhale, journey to the top of your mat, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. On your inhale, left knee comes into the chest. 
one-legged mountain. Exhale, step your left foot all the way back. Sweep the arms behind you for lightning bolt. Keeping your body as is, except for your arms. We'll inhale, reach them forward. Exhale, reach them back. Two more, inhale. And exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Find an interlace behind your back. Pull your shoulder blades together. Ground through your right foot as you slowly lift up into warrior three. Keep your interlace as you reach the crown of the head down to the mat. Left leg lifts a little bit higher for toppling tree pose. Release your hands down to the mat. Standing splits. Inhale. Exhale, Shiva squat. Inhale, standing splits. Exhale, Shiva squat. Hold here or baby grasshopper. Take your right hand to pinky edge of your back foot. Left hand grounds out to the side and then begin to lower your hips as you extend through your left leg. Slowly reversing your steps, standing splits, inhale, exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift, exhale, fold. Inhale, rise, high mountain. Exhale, hands to the heart. Stay for your inhale. Exhale, out the mouth, let it go. Inhale, high mountain. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Plant your hands. Flow through your vinyasa. Meet me in down dog. From your down dog, left leg rises. Exhale, knee to left elbow. Inhale it up. Exhale to the right. Inhale up. Exhale, knee to nose, step it through. Right foot 45 degrees. Inhale, rise, warrior one. One full round of breath. One more inhale. Exhale, standing splits. Plant your hands, right toes up to the sky. Release your right toes to the back of the mat. Inhale, high crescent. Exhale, open arm twist to the left. Inhale, revolved crescent. Exhale, lunge twist. Right hand plant, left arm to the sky. Release your hand inside of your foot, open up Skandasana. Inhale, hips through center. Exhale to the right. Rotate to the back of your mat, lower your left knee down. Inhale, low lunge. Exhale, half splits. Inhale, low lunge. Exhale, open up to your low warrior two. Inhale, reverse. We'll plant our left hand to the top of the mat, lengthen through our right leg. And then release your right hand to the top of your mat. Tuck your right toes, hug your left knee into the chest. Inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, knee to nose, step it through. Right toes lift, standing splits. Find length on your inhale. Exhale, Shiva squat, right knee tucks behind left. Inhale, standing splits. Exhale, Shiva. Inhale. 
exhale. This time on your inhale, open up half moon, stack your right hip on top of left, right fingertips, reach for the sky. With control, step your right foot to the back of the mat, inhale, reverse triangle. Exhale, rotate to the back of your mat, left hand plants, inhale, right arm up. Stay in your twist. Inhale, revolve crescent. Exhale, open up warrior two. Inhale, lengthen through your right leg, palms connect overhead. Exhale, warrior two, top of your mat. On your inhale, reverse warrior, reach your right arm towards the top. Exhale, extended side angle, bottom arm reaches to the back. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, side angle. Inhale. And exhale. Hold here. Reach your left arm out in front of you. And then plant it outside of your foot for your deep extended side angle. Right hand plants, come into your long pyramid pose. Ball of your right foot, maybe step it up a little bit, and then flex the left toes towards your face. From here, ground through your hands. We'll sweep our left toes to the sky. Inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, knee to right elbow, thread it through, open up, fall in triangle. Release your hips down to the mat. Inhale, reach your arms up. Exhale, fold over your right leg. Inhale, windmill the hands to the top of your mat. Tuck your right toes. Inhale, three like a dog. Exhale, knee to nose, step it through. Inhale, high crescent. Exhale, plant your hands. Inhale, three like a dog. Then lower your right knee down to the mat. Reach your right arm out in front of you, sunbird balance. Exhale, knee to elbow. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, pull it in. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, in. Inhale, lengthen. Hold it here. Reach around. Grab hold of your left foot. But if you have it, tabletop. Three rounds of cat cow. Move at your pace. Flow with your breath. So after you finish your last round. We'll tuck our toes, lift the hips up and back, down dog. Inhale, rise to the tippy toes, gaze forward. Exhale, journey to the top of your mat, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. On your inhale, right knee into the chest, one-legged mountain. Exhale, step it back, lightning bolt. Inhale, reach your arms overhead, keep the torso low. Exhale, reach the arms back. Two more, inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Interlace behind your back, put your other thumb on top this time. Pull the shoulder blades together. Ground through your left foot and slowly rise for warrior three. Top 
toppling tree. Reach the crown of your head down as right toes lift a little bit higher. Hands down to the mat, standing splits, inhale. Exhale, Shiva squat. Inhale, standing splits. Exhale, Shiva. Hold it here or baby grasshopper. Left hand comes to pinky edge of your right foot behind you. Right hand out to the side. Lower your hips as you extend through your right leg. Slowly reverse your steps, standing splits, inhale. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, rise high mountain. Exhale, hands to the heart. Stay for your inhale. Exhale, out the mouth, let it go. Inhale, high mountain. Exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold, plant your hands. Take your final vinyasa. Meet me in down dog. And then from your down dog, maybe hop your legs through or lower the knees. Sweep the feet out in front of you. Send your feet all the way to the top of the mat. Inhale, reach your arms up. Exhale, forward fold. Slowly roll up through the spine. We'll take our right foot, step it outside of our left thigh. Right hand pops up behind you. Inhale, sweep left arm up and over, twist to the right. Sitting up nice and tall. Find length on your inhales through the spine. And then twist a little bit further on your exhales. Unwind from your twist, counter twist, rotate to the left, grab your hands, give a little bow, lift up through the torso, ground through your left hand and your right foot, on your inhale, lift through the hips, reach through your right arm for horizon lunge. Lower your hips back down, keep the figure four shape of the legs, right foot rests on top of your left thigh. Hands plant behind you, fingertips face forward. We'll bring our left sole of foot to the mat. Scooting your hips as close as you can towards your heel to feel a nice stretch in your right hip. Actively flex your right foot to protect your knee. On your next inhale, lift up through your hips for a figure four reverse tabletop. Really pressing through your left foot and the palms of your hands. Maybe lift your hips high enough so that they're in line with your knee. Extend your right leg up to the sky. And then lower your hips down, right leg long. We'll step our left foot outside of our right thigh. Left hand pops up behind you. Inhale, sweep right arm up and over to twist to the left. A few rounds of breath. Gently unwind from your twist. Plant your hands to the right, take your bow. Rise up, ground through your right hand and your left foot. Inhale, rise for horizon lunge. Release your hips back down. 
find your figure four with your left foot resting on top of your right thigh. Hands plant behind you and then slide your right foot to ground onto your mat, stretching out through your left hip. On your next inhale, we'll press up into our figure four reverse tabletop. If it feels okay on your neck, you can gently drop your head back. Extend your left leg up to the sky. Release your hips down, left leg long. Right foot meets left. Inhale, reach your arms up. Exhale, forward fold. Roll up through the spine, and then roll it right down onto your back. Soles if you come to the mat. Preparing for a round of bridge pose. Bring your arms down by your side, palms connect to the mat. Walk your heels a little bit closer to your glutes. On your inhale, lift up through your hips. Maybe find an interlace of the hands under the back and walk the shoulders closer together. Can you lift your hips a little bit higher? Rise to your tippy toes, hold. Release your hands if you had them interlaced. Slowly roll your back down from top to bottom. Pause in stillness. Then find happy baby, soles of feet up to the sky, reaching for calves, big toes, pinky edges of your feet, little rock from side to side on your back. Lengthen through the legs. An option for legs up the wall. Extend the soles of the feet up to the sky, hips stay on the ground. Or for shoulder stand, lift through the hips. Bring your hands to your back for support. Weight is in your triceps and shoulders, not your neck. Option to drop the toes behind you overhead, moving towards a plow pose. And then wherever you are, gently rolling out into Supta Baddha Konasana. Soles of feet together, knees fall open wide. And plant your hands on top of your hips. Maybe you stay just like this for Shavasana. Otherwise, begin to extend your arms and legs long towards the top of your mat. Staying in Shavasana for as long as your day allows. Whenever you're ready to continue with your day, inviting natural movement back into your body. Thank you so much for practicing with me today. The light in me sees, honors, loves, and is grateful for the light in each of you. From my heart to yours. Namaste.